Yeah. <laughs> More curses. More curses. More curses. You may want to go for this guy because he's going to split. I, would, I, yeah. I think he's going to split regardless. I don't think he can kill him with one shot. Yeah, but, I mean, but he's it's going to hurt himself, so maybe we can uh, kill it. That's true. That's true. He'll hurt himself. You're right. That's I a good call. I was going to hit all three of them, but... I'll can you? Yeah. Oh. Let's oh, you did hit all three? What? Hit all? Yeah, oh, do it. Oh, you've got the mine. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Do it, do it, do it. Yeah, that'd be excellent. Do it, do it, do it. Yeah, that's that's worth it. Yes, do that. Yes, yes, yes. Ten Please out of do. ten. Perfect. Oh, wait. And you got the goggles? Oh, never mind. No, I already... Because I short-rested, so... It's okay. This is fine. That's still fantastic. That's mine. Nice. Wow. Right. We still have a chance. Remember, there's still a chest underneath the annoying yeah. things. But we'll get to that in a moment. And then the next next turn, when they're unstunned, I can stun this one again by moving them into that Ooh. trap. Oh. Ooh. Nice. I've got the, the, the doom compass thing. Doom. Burn, but it's worth a burn. Do you mind if I just loot? I can just loot the chest now. I figure I yeah, probably just should just do that. Get it, yeah. Get it, get it, get it. Wand of inferior Infernos design. Mm. I'm assuming that generates fire. Yeah. All right. That's good on someone else, other than me. Murder. Murder. All right. We will have five oozes left to contend with. No <laughs> elemental requests. No, Samuel. I've got to sleep. Okay. Then annoying ooze is going to. We just have to kill these oozes and we're home free. Yes, done. <laughs> yes, done. We're getting to the end. Mm-hmm. We're almost there. Just a few more rounds. You might survive till the end. We'll see. Whoa! I don't suppose anyone can throw darkness on the board, can they? Uh, I can, but then I won't be able to attack. Oh, then don't worry about it. Yes, I can. Yes? How early? 37. Uh, you can't go any earlier than that, can you? Okay, then don't, that's fine. It doesn't matter then. Okay. It doesn't matter. I gotta go 30, it, the, the darkness will be there. <laughs> Where, what, be when? 37. <laughs> oh, okay, well. Yeah. I can I'm throw it up at 15. Um, yeah. Um, if you can throw it up at 15, that then, then I can use it. Cool. Hold on, um, let me just change what I'm doing. Yeah. 15, you said? Yep. Okay. All right. I'm good to go. Cool. Uh, no, no. But you'll okay. assassinate, right? I, I mean, I can't assassinate, but I can at least stab, okay. stab. Stab, stab. But I'm going to just... Gold. Yeah. I'm just going to keep hitting the elite, because the elite needs to go down. Yeah. Oh, you can reach it. Just, just out of range. All right, that's fine. Thank you for that. I think I'm fine where I am. Double my attack. It's going to be an attack four. Nice. Right. That's good. Okay. That means yeah. the next that means the next time it splits it's gonna die. Yeah. Invisible. 
good, good, good. We need it. You don't need an element in the next round, do you? I gotta take a nap. Okay. And then uh, the turn after my nap is my last turn. Stunning one of them, Kevin. I am. Oh. Oh. <gasps> yeah. Great. Awesome. Oh, snap. That one's gonna die. The one with the one's gonna die. Yeah, move the six, yeah. Nice. Done. That one's gonna split, but at least it's still lower hit points. We just have to do a bunch of AOEs, and yeah, the next time that one splits, it's gonna die. That one dies. Nice. Stupid oozes. Stupid annoying oozes. I think we have a chance. We just have to get a short rest. gonna kill us because I have that stun cardigan where I can stun three yeah so should I go for these oops that one, that one. I think that's where I'm gonna aim one, two, so I have to move all right I'm gonna murder the ooze next to me just so you know yeah okay the elite or the regular the regular. Okay. Um, I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna try and get this one down. We don't have retaliate up, correct? Or do we? No, we have disadvantage on the. Okay, attacks. that's fine. That's fine. It's fine. I have two more rounds and then I'm out. Just so you know, the I'm oh, exhausted. Yeah. So hope good luck, y'all. I'm doing what I can. I think I'm out. How do you tell the round? It tells you at the beginning of each turn. I don't remember what it was. Oh, no this worries. time, I think it was 18 last I checked. Oof. Uh, I think it's 20 now. Oh yeah, round 20. You can see in the log. Oh, they're about to split. Um, this guy's gonna die then. Yeah, that guy's gonna die, so that's good. Don't worry about him. If you can... I'll be able to if... stun this one. That one. Like, that group, that triangle right Yeah, there. don't... Just don't stun the one that's gonna die. Yeah. Don't stun... Yeah, just... Yeah. Nice, Kevin. That's a stun. Nice. Cool. Nice. That one actually is going to die if it ever splits. splits. Okay. Uh, um, I don't know if you need dark. Yeah, it's it's already on the board, but. Oh, okay. 
so you're fine. Okay. Can you? Yeah. Um, in that case, let's see. Can you stun um, the ones that are? I can stun like that one. Can you can that you stun one. this one and this one? Yeah. yeah. Just those and only those, so that this one will die. Yeah. Oh, uh, that one's already stunned. This guy's already. Oh stunned. yeah, that's and he's. I guess he's already stunned, so it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter then at that point. Just stun this one and this one, because I'm gonna murder this one. Okay. And this one's gonna die. Yeah. Just those two. Thank you. Nice. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. And then you can curse. I think I'm gonna move three and I might be able to do one more round and bop that guy. Yeah, I think you should. And then that's, that's pretty much all I'm gonna be able to do. I think Kevin can solo this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I still have my AOE before I exhaust, so I'm hoping oh, to take out. Yeah, get in there. And <laughs> get, is it a burn? Is it a burn? <laughs> no, it's it's the one okay. I keep using every round. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Do you need any elements for it, or you're good? Um, I think I'm gonna... Murder. Yeah, it generates elements instead of takes them. Okay. Do you fail if you, um, well, no, I guess you get your XP and everything, so... Anyway. You get your XP, you get your kills, so it's not, yeah, we didn't lose anything by, even if we don't win this, we don't lose anything. And it actually gives me an excuse to go back and get more Vermlings. Yeah, but that's true. Let's try to, let's try to finish it if we can. I think we're super close. Yeah, I think, I think if we play our cards right, we'll win. Is that, yeah, we actually that one's dead. Yeah, we have to play cards. <laughs> <laughs> I get it, I get it. I hope I did that right. I think I was supposed to put my ditty down. Do you Go exhaust? Ahead, I hope. Yeah, yeah, take your ditty down. Taking your ditty down is good. Because then you'll have one more card left. Did you take the ditty down? The form. Not last round. Oh, well, we'll see what happens. I might exhaust, but... Ooh, back at full health. Alright, I have literally one more turn left, so which one do I want? Which two do I want? Kill one normal. Okay. That's fine. Okay. I yeah, am this going... is my last turn. I will murder this one as the last thing Excellent. I do. Excellent. Murder that one. If it's the last thing I do. If it's the last thing I do. So you just have to do nine damage, everybody. Nine damage, people. I might actually be able to help. So I'm gonna cool. bop this guy in front of me, and then I've also got an attack four, range four, push three. Okay, that's oh, good. Nice. Do that. But I'm definitely exhausted after this. So. Yeah, that's fine. I think we'll be okay. I think we'll be fine. They're about to split. Ooh. Make sure. It's okay. A bunch of them are gonna die if they split. Yeah, this guy's gonna die. That guy's gonna die, so don't worry about him. Oh, I'm yeah, going to if you kill. Can do two damage. Do two dead. damage to him and he will die. Yeah. Yep. Nice. And then nice. get the last elite. Attack the last elite and we're good. We're set. Yeah. Attack the last elite and we're set. Yeah. And he's poisoned, so that helps. No, there's the plus four. Excellent. What a way to end. I what uh, a way. didn't get my pacifist thing where I kill fewer than. <laughs> <laughs> this is the wrong one. This is the wrong one. Yes. Dang it. Oh, wrong so... one for that. All right. Okay. 
Murder. Murder, death, kill. Glorious murder. All right, and then the other one is just gonna kill itself, but by we all means. We did it! Oh my we god! We did it, everybody! By the skin of our teeth. Skin of our teeth. Oh my goodness, that was. Woo! That's a great way to we end the day. Need to work for that. Yeah. Woo! Good job, everybody. Woo! Good job. That was. That was not easy. Woo! Woo! I think the fact that those all those vermlings bunched up. Like that a few rounds ago. Yeah. That, yeah, that was me. That was me. <laughs> that was me. Yeah. I was like, All what's right. going on? Why is every why is the floor highlighted? Cool. Um I guess I'll just do my own thing. Yeah. Um burn for XP. Get oh that's right. Get some coin. Get some XP. Bottom of formless power. Don't move. Oh yeah, you're right. And then I clicked right as I was like, wait a moment. Alright, I guess. Never mind. Oh well. No 2 XP. I get six, three, three gold, gold though. Yeah. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> three gold's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Way more coins. Yeah. Oof. Thanks a lot, Mind Thief. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is cult down here? Mm -hmm. How dare you poison everything? Water on the floor. Investigating further, you find new poisons of any kind on the corpses. Is it possible this family were not the cause of <gasps> just living here, away from the eyes of the guard? Well, that's sad. Oh my god. They were definitely not innocent. Um, they have <laughs> an affidavit saying that they <laughs> did things. At the back <laughs> of the room. Large cracks are I killed 15 in enemies? Wow. A passage deeper Ooh, into the depths. Ooh, a passage deeper into the depths. 25 XP! You may even be Eight, able to nine, enter the cistern and find the source that way. Wow. Over enemies. Dang. Look how many enemies there were. 15 plus 11 plus 6 plus 4? So that's, uh, what, 20, 36? Yeah, Jesus. 36 Ooh, enemies? Kevin? Kevin got his two perk points. Congratulations. Yeah, congrats. Yeah. I would have forgotten about that. I would have been like, gold, gold, oh. Gold. That's right. I'm not supposed to get gold. Oh, Kevin, we we, we retired Ke We retired three people wow. today. Wow. And Samantha isn't really far away from that either. I think she I'm might retire in either the next round or next scenario right. or two. <laughs> Pretty lights. <laughs> Pretty lights. Pretty lights. Oh. Still thinking. Yeah, eight XP. We Six got XP? the Drake Nest. Deep ruins. Okay. Kill 15 verm. I got four. All right. Oh, wow. All right. I mean, that's still good. That's not bad. Ooh, Kevin. Just needs 10 more. Yeah. Kill Elite. Oh, you're halfway there. <laughs> you're halfway. You are. <laughs> the slowest to retire is like shh, Zoom. Zoom. Zooming to retire. I actually really like the Elementalist a lot. Good. Well, he might, he could be your main. He might yeah. be a good main then. I'm glad you like him. Um, yeah, so I think all Kevin has to do is donate, and we'll see another, um, we'll see another retirement. We'll also see what, um... All right. Did, you, uh, did it give you a... Um, here we go. All right. <clears throat> Announce retirement. Yes. Woo. I'm gonna miss this one. Aww. <laughs> Not me. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, actually. <laughs> Go ahead, Kevin. You had to stay longer than you would have liked, but eventually you managed to redirect enough of this wretched city's gold into the local sanctuary and allow it to make a difference here. Uh, thanks to you, Gloomhaven is on its way to becoming an actual haven of hope. While you think 
While thanks be to the oak, you can finally leave this vile place and volunteer <laughs> at another fallen city. He's the one saying we're vile. <laughs> oh. One which doesn't smell so much like reanimated corpses. Excuse me. I thought you liked that kind of smell. Yeah. <laughs> it's food. <laughs> uh-huh. uh, the Temple of the Great Oak can send some other poor soul here to look after Gloomhaven. Wow, bitter. Queen B has retired. Next class. Oh, yes. Sawbones. 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 So, uh, let's talk about the sawbones. Uh, he was actually one of the last classes that I played. I had a lot of fun with him. He is a melee support character. Um, a lot. He does have a lot of cool um, debuffs with his melee attacks that includes things like poisoning and wounding and disarming and stuns. Um, and uh, one of the game mechanics that is unique to him is he has cards that let him pass out med packs, medical packs, because he's basically a battle medic. Um, and what that is, is the med packs are actually additional cards that you give to your other players, which has a heal for top and a heal for bottom, which you can also use to do a basic attack top or a basic move bottom if you want. And so some of you might be thinking, well, what's so powerful about this having an additional card in your hand. Well, the more cards you have in your hand, the harder it is to exhaust you. It takes longer for you to exhaust, right? Because you have additional cards in your hand. Ah. Um, once you use a med pack, it does go back to the um, to the Sawbones' supply. He has like eight, I think, in his supply. So there is a limited amount, but just like curses and blesses, you know, as you use them, it just goes back and then he can redistribute the med pack back to people again. So, um, really interesting uh, mechanic. Um, you cannot use the med pack cards to avoid damage, because you know how you can like burn cards to avoid damage? You can't use them for that, but they still are crazy useful for their ability to heal in the top or the bottom, or just use as a basic attack or basic move and make it that much slower for you to exhaust so that's amazing yeah yep so um kevin you basically now have a choice between um two melee support characters because the paladin also does support um i would argue that the sawbones does more support and debuffing than the um than the uh uh sunkeeper does they do about the same damage output. Um, the thing that the Sunkeeper is good at is tanking, because um, I wouldn't say the Sun. I wouldn't say that the Sawbones is a great tank. He's probably like a soft tank, if anything. Um, the Quartermaster might actually be a better tank than the Sun than the uh, Sawbones. So I will leave it up to you. Which class sounds more appealing? This um, to you. I mean, I gotta go with the Sun Keeper for sure. Yeah, I, I figured you might want the Sun Keeper. Um, yeah, go for get the Sun Keeper. Let's see if we can um, get a personal quest that doesn't sound annoying to complete. <laughs> so, uh, character name Cedric. <laughs> Actually, well, well, the Sun Keeper is technically female. Uh, Cedrina. <laughs> Cedrina. <laughs> it's actually a pretty name. <laughs> Cedrina is a pretty name, pretty name actually. Um, uh, the Sunkeeper is also a Valrath, you in case you were Sunny. wondering. Sunny. <laughs> oh man, I should have called my character Cher then. Oh. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah, I like Sunny. You like Sunny? Okay, yeah. yeah. Call him Sunny, and then, um, yeah, let us know if what the uh, personal quest requirements are, if 
any of them don't look frustrating to do. All right. Um, ones kill till kill 20 bandits are cultists. Okay. And that unlocks a design that we already have. Okay. Oh. Quest. Uh, the Tremor Blade. And oh. the other one is Zealot of the Blood God. <laughs> what? Ooh, what? What do you have to do? Become exhausted 12 times. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Um, but that unlocks the the lightning bolt, which I think you're I, really hard. So. Yeah. I think I think I would re-roll because we don't want a duplicate. I don't want that duplicate tremor, tremor blade. Yeah. Um, and 20 cultists and bandits. I don't know when we're going to find those anytime soon. So re-roll your character and see what other personal quests you can get. I do um, love the name Zealot of the Blood God, though. <laughs> I should probably go to bed. Yeah. Go ahead, Sam. We'll we'll just wrap up here and yeah. get a personal quest, and then we'll we'll play again. Cool. Like in another Saturday. Yeah. So um, thanks for staying with us. Though. Yeah. Good luck. Have fun. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, Sam. Good night. Good night. Good night. Um, so what? this one is the fall of man, which mm -hmm. is complete two different scenarios in the lingering swamp, then unlock fading lookout and follow it to conclusion. That unlocks the circlet of elements design. I don't know if we have that. Okay. Um, and then the Goliath toppler complete four boss scenarios and that unlocks the brilliant blade design. Okay. Um, so we have, we do have a lingering swamp one, but that one requires us to do the mysterious voices bidding. Oh. If you remember the voice, I don't oh, know if we yeah, want to yeah. necessarily do that necessarily. Oh, no. <laughs> um, so if you want, we the boss one is possible. Um, we can do that if you like that one. Um, it's also possible that we'll unlock other things in the Lingering Swamp. It's also possible that we can get more Lingering Swamp missions. So, um, I don't know how easy it is to do that. It's probably, to be honest, I feel like um, getting more Lingering Swamp um, missions is probably just as, just as easy as finding four bosses. So, One of the side quests has a boss right now, the Temple of the Eclipse, that has a boss. Um, I could always re-roll if that... Yeah, you re-roll again if you want. Yeah, re-roll if you'd like. Let's see what else you get. There might be something a little bit easier. One thing I really want you to get is one that says, um, get a mission from like these five different places, but we'll see what you get. So this one is kill eight forest imps, and it unlocks the blinking cape design. Okay. Oh, blinking cape. That sounds like a really good item. It does. I might actually like that. Um, what's the other one? Um, oh, sorry. It says eight forest imps, and then unlock the scenario Forgotten Grove and follow it to camp. Okay. And the other one is... Find the skull vein axe and the necromancer's <gasps> sanctum, and then use it to kill seven living bones and corpses or spirits. And that unlocks the major cure potion design. I think we've okay. got the skull bones. We we have it. So you just have to kill a bunch of. I mean, all you have to do is equip it and then kill a bunch of undead with it, which is very paladiny, honestly. It is. <laughs> um. However, the blinking the blinking cape sounds like an awesome item, but I I don't know if um, that needs to be a deciding factor. So fun outside. Thank you, Brody. <laughs> it is fun outside, what are you Brody. Doing? Um, I definitely think. Well, I don't. Uh, the the Skullbane axe sounds easier just because we have yeah the thing already. But yeah, I, I agree. Like the blinking cape too. So I'm. I'm down to take whichever one. Um, I mean, I'm going to retire in like five or four side quests. So 
Yeah. I can roll for it next time. Yeah, I mean, we could just keep rolling until we find a blinking cape, honestly. Um, if you like that other one, that is. I mean, is the major cure potion, is that, is that worth it? I don't. Um, major cure, let me see what the blinking cape does. So, major, major cure potion, Gloomhaven. Um, that, during your turn, remove all negative conditions on yourself. This can be used while you have stun. So the minor removed one negative condition. That one removes all negative conditions, including stun. Mm. The blinking cape. Um, during your turn, um, during your turn, perform a move for jump action. Um, which is, yeah, move for jump action, and then you you burn it. It's a burnable item. Um, the blinking cape is worth is more valuable than the other potion. Um, it's fifty versus the other one, which is thirty. So, yeah, it's just it just gives you extra movement. So, but it's a body. It's a body um, piece. So. Um, I'm. I'm fine with taking one of these or re-rolling or whichever one you think is best part. I I say let's choose the easier one since we already have the axe. And it just seems very thematic for your character to slay a bunch of undead with it. Cool. Um, Cause then that'll, cause, cause the, the sooner we can retire all the classes, the sooner we can finally like choose yeah. our base our, our main class yeah so yeah. that's what i would recommend it'll it'll in the long run it'll be a better investment to go with the easier one sure so yeah uh did you want me to read the quest description or yeah please do okay uh the scourge of the undead is upon you you can feel the presence of unnatural life choking the world you have heard tales of a legendary holy axe held by a vile necromancer. Your goal is simple. Kill the necromancer, take the axe, and lay waste to the undead menace. Um, so the first thing you need to do is get enough gold to buy the axe. Yeah. And then once you have the axe, we can go slaughtering undead. So, um, which, which can be done. Um, do you want to read about the Sunkeeper before we close? Sure. Uh, I just got an error. Oh, really? Yeah, I just desynced. Oh. Um. Um, yeah, it's forcing me to go to the main menu. That's fine. I can invite you again. Alright, I'll invite you again. There you go. This session is just like... I know, just... I've got so many shinies. I'm glad that um, Sam liked the Elementalist, I think. Mm -hmm. It's a cool. It's a cool class to try to master. Um, cool. Are you able to bring it up now, um, Kevin? Oh, I have to sign you a mercenary. There you go. Uh, okay. Okay. So the Sun Keepers have been trained to tap into a long dormant demonic power and harness them for the purpose of righteousness. The Sun Keeper has an assortment of healing, buffing, healing, buffing, and card recovery abilities and is capable and is a capable melee fighter in her own right. She works best in the role of a paladin, aiding the main damage dealers in combat while keeping them alive. That's me! <laughs> <laughs> Uh, strength, 
Array of buffs, heals, and recovery options. Competent melee combatant. And uses light to enhance her abilities. Which is good for the elementalist. Yes. So. Uh, weakness. Can struggle against groups of smaller enemies. Weaker with fewer allies. And rather self-righteous a lot of the time. <laughs> no. Really? I, what? Really, Cedric? <laughs> really, Cedric? <laughs> 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 I think you will enjoy that class a lot. She's very powerful. She's got a lot of cool cards. I think she actually... I don't know when... Um, uh, when she gets it, but... Um, my friend who played the Sunkeeper, one of his favorite cards, there's a card that actually makes the Sunkeeper and her allies invincible to damage for a round. Holy cow. It's, it's like a burn with a two experience, but it's just nobody takes damage for wow. a whole turn. It's so nice. <laughs> That's crazy. It's, yeah. Um, so yeah, 